Hello. On this video, I'm going to show you something that I found that I haven't found in a long time. I went to a, well, actually a friend called me and told me I needed to go to this church sale in the next town over. And uh, <coughs> she said they had jewelry, but what she didn't tell me was they had these. I have not found a jewelry jar in, I think, years. Because our local jewelry stopped doing it before the pandemic. They stopped selling jewelry jars. And uh, I have been buying most of my stuff online. And through, you know, I will find locals that have box, jewel, box jewelry for sale. And uh, so I went because she said they had jewelry. I wasn't going to go. And then I thought, uh, well, they had these. And as you can see, these are small. These are maybe... Maybe the size of a tomato sauce jar. But they had a ton of these. And uh, the lady at the church told me that it's, it was a church, like a, I forget what they called it, like a fall festival or something. And then they had a section that was like garage sale stuff and a section that was craft stuff. And uh, they said one of their um, church members uh, deals in box lot jewelry that she sells online so she probably does the same thing that I do uh, and she gave them a giant box of jewelry and then other members um, added to it with stuff they had and they put it all together and they had one night where they put them in jars and I don't remember how many jars there were but I promise you I didn't buy all of them but I did buy six of them I bought uh, five of these nine dollar ones the smaller ones and then one large one I don't remember it's in the other room, so I don't remember how much that one was. That one was probably like $20 or something. I don't actually remember. But, um, so I'm going to open two of these today. And stay tuned after the video. Um, I've got the winner of the uh, giveaway from two videos ago. And then next week's video, I'll do probably do two more of these or a box. And um, next week, I'm going to do another giveaway. So, please like and subscribe this video. It doesn't cost you anything to subscribe and, and like. If you enjoy these videos, I mean, there's a lot of people out here doing this. Please subscribe to mine. And there's two. Because they people put a lot of work into this stuff. And it's fun. And it really helps us if you subscribe. So, please. And the, the winner should be at the bottom. The reason why I saw this one, like I said, I bought, I didn't buy them all because I didn't want to be greedy. I probably would have liked to have bought all of them. I don't know how many there were. There were quite a few. But I did buy six. But look at this little kitty. Isn't that cute? I don't know what's in here for jewelry, but that cat is adorable. And these are canning jars, and I'm going to can some pickles next year. I probably might have to buy new lids, but... That's six canning jars I didn't have. They're not very big jars, but I can do two of them. All right, this is uh, acrylic, but it's really pretty. It's still got a decent stretch to it. All right, let's find a place for this. Put this over here, and there's another stretch. Let me get this light a little closer. It's acrylic. That one's a little bit looser. Still got a good stretch to it, though. I'm going to redo some of the stretch ones that I have with cord, and um, I might do a video on that. And here's a ring. Is this a... Oh, look at this. It's a watch. Of course, it's not running. How cute is that? I guess it needs to be wound. I don't know. But it's a stretch. Kind of, still kind of small. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Let's see if I can show you the... It's very small. Isn't that adorable? Well, that's cute. Let's see if I can get that working. This light here makes absolutely no difference, does it? All right, we have a pins. is really vintage looking. 
no name on it. That's a cute little rose. I've seen this one a million times. I like the ones that are enameled, the, the single roses that are enameled. Let's put the pins up there. What is this? Oh, this is a pin and a pendant. And look how beautiful that is. Is there any stones missing? I don't see any stones missing. Oh, that is pretty. Let me get this light up here. Can you see that? Gosh, that's pretty. Put the pins in one place. I'm going to do a whatnot sale with this stuff later in the... What the heck is this? Okay, now I'm confused. All right, let's... Oh, look at that. That's different. Where's my... Somebody said I should get a bigger one of these, but I don't really have the camera room anyways to show anything much bigger look at that it has chains hanging from a black chain well that's different i don't think i've ever seen that before in the i like those chains oh that is pretty and you know i do have it finally thought to take a tape measure out stick it around my neck so i can measure these chains and I will be putting these for sale and whatnot, probably the Monday or Tuesday after. I'll put the link on there. This is, well, to the, to here, it's an 18-inch chain. That's a nice size necklace. That's pretty. So far, good stuff. What is this? This is a little fish with a, almost a mosaic stone there. Isn't that cute? A little jelly belly fish. It looks a little bit like micro mosaic, but I don't know if it is. No name on the back. It looks well made, though. Does he have a... Oh, no, he has a rhinestone eyeball. I'll put that with the pins. This is an earring, and I did ask, are they going to be single earrings, and she said she had no idea. The lady that was at the checkout table. So there's a pink, well, it's more peach, but. There's stuff in plastic in here. I'm going to try and get it all out of the jar. Not a lot of stuff in here. Oh, here's another pen. Look at this pen. This is a hand. A hand wired one. Oh, my fingernails are getting in my way today. All right, turn it that way. All right. It's like a little basket of flowers or a little wreath of flowers. It's really cute. It's got pins in here. I didn't expect pins at all. What is this? Oh, this has got a tag on it. This is probably from their lady that sells the stuff. This is Chico's. Look at that gorgeous necklace. Oh, I love this stone right here. And it is acrylic, of course, but... Chico's has nice quality. And this is... I'm going to try and remember to give links on this. This is about 20 inches with a... 4 inch um, extender. These two beads are gorgeous. Look at these two. This one's got kind of a swirl to it. And then this one's got a raised area. They're all nice. All right, necklaces I will put right here. So I am going to put these up for sale like Monday or Tuesday night. Oh, here's it. This little baggie was a pair of earrings. These are pretty. The green stone. Look at that. Those are pretty. Hmm. Well, there will be some in pairs, I guess. I don't know if there's a pair to that other one. This looks like a clock. All right, this is... Uh, oh, here's the little cat. 
That is adorable. Look at that. I don't know, but that looks like a taco to me. I don't know what it's supposed to be. Maybe an egg roll. Just get a little fan. I'm going to keep that right up here. All right, we have... Ooh, that's scary. Look at that one on a very long chain. And the chain is approximately 30 inches long. It's one of those, I guess it's called Rolo chains, but it's in gunmetal. Look at that. That's a really Halloween-y looking thing, isn't it? Like a demon. I'll put that aside. All right, we have a good stretch on this bracelet. Look at that. It has like a peach colored anchor. It has all its rhinestones. Yep. Looks cute on, doesn't it? Very fall color. Peachy orange. That with the bracelets. It's just a plastic one. It's a plastic one with a stretch. This one's cute. They're little half moon things. Probably a six and a half to a seven. So it just snugly fits me. And I think about a seven and a half and a bracelet to eight. Another pin. Oh, I like this. I haven't been getting any pins from my, not very many pins. Let's say I've got some. That's pretty. Very vintagey looking. No maker on it, but still very vintage. A little bit of wear right there. See that discoloration a little bit, but it's not bad. All right, here's another earring. Put all the single earrings up here. Here is a pendant. That is going to be the smallest chain I have ever seen. Oh, it's got a knot in it, that's why. I'll have to take some time to take the knot out, but it's a little butterfly. Is it missing its stone? Oh, no, it has a mother of pearl stone, but it's kind of set back a little. See that? Without the, the knot in it, which I will work to get out, it's probably about an 18-inch chain. Let's put that up there for, to work on. We have a stick pin. Look at that. Looks like jadeite. I don't know if it is. But isn't that pretty? You see that color? I'm going to pull both of these forward a little. All right, we have another bracelet. This one has a gunmetal tone to it, lobster clasp. I don't know where my measuring thing for that went, but this is a seven inch with three inch extender. So this would go quite large. And it's got these little acrylic balls on it. Little disco ball looking thing. That's cute. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, these are nice glass stones and rhinestone rondelles. Good stretch to it. Probably about a seven inch bracelet. I like that. With nice fall colors on that. And the way I picked these, I mean, I picked... I'd find one thing in the jar I liked, and then I don't know now because it's been a week what was the thing I liked. I love this cha-cha bracelet. It's got a good stretch to it. And it's gold and antique gold and kind of a, kind of a root beer looking. It's really nice. I like that bracelet. 
see what else we got. Like I said, stay tuned at the end, or I will actually put the name of the winner down below in the description if you, you can't make it to the end of the video. I hope you can. I would watch all of your videos. Yes, we do really appreciate I, I mean, I really appreciate it if you subscribe because I'm trying to build this channel and it's going very slowly. And, you know, you try and do what people want. I enjoy doing this. I'm going to be doing it anyways because I sell the jewelry, but so. And I know people like watching these. I wish as many people like watching, like watching, like subscribing. That would help all of us out. This is weird. Okay, so this is a two-piece chain. That's about 14 inches right there. It's 16 about to there. Um, it's got little tiny gold discs and another little thin gold chain. And then at the end, there's a chain on a... So it's like, what, a Y chain is what they call it. And it doesn't have a tag on it. I'm not expecting many of these to have tags. I'm sure the lady that donated that sells stuff would, would probably keep the stuff that was oh that's nice we'll keep the stuff that had makers names on it donate the stuff that didn't that's nice like a, a dove of peace it's two stick pins in this already up oh, another one of these um i don't think it's breast cancer because that's not really pink that's peach if anybody knows what the peach one means let me know all right here's another earring it's not boating well i don't see the matches to any of those but they might be in the other jars hopefully they're in the jars i took all right this is a nice necklace does it have a maker name on it this is ny these are pretty pretty beads acrylic beads this is gold one <coughs> pardon me i don't have my drink with me this is pink with a, can you see the glitter tone to that? It's very faint, but and this is a gold with almost a crackle tone painted on the back. See, it's gold painted on, like a dull gold painted on the back, and then the front is clear with crackle. And then here's some more crackle. Oh, this is a pretty one. This really is a pretty one. This is NY, and I, I like some of their stuff, especially their beaded stuff. Oh. I do like beads. All right, we're going to put that on there. We're going to double it up and see what it looks like, because that's probably how you'd wear it, because this is long. Let me give you an idea how long this is. This is 30 inches long. 32 inches long. Look at that. All right, there how, there's how it looks doubled up. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Especially like this pink bead. That's pretty. Like I said, these will be for sale on my whatnot. And there's a link below in the description to not only my whatnot account or, and the sale that this stuff is going to be on, but there's also going to be a link to, uh, if you haven't done whatnot before, a free $10. Well, this is weird. For sale. Hmm. Little angel pin. No markings on it. Oh, it's also a pendant. And it says for sale. That is just strange. Why would an angel be for sale? Okay, and here's another angel. This is a another pendant. Oh, this is the MD Anderson something. MD Anderson something center children's art project. Look at that. Is that cute? And it's a pendant or a pen. Nice weight to it. Oh, I'm hoping these earrings are in one of them. The ones I picked were all sitting together, so let's hope that meant something. Because they had just put them out when I got, or they were putting them out. My friend told me they had jewelry. And they did have some single jewelry, but maybe they had more out before I got there. But they were just putting these jars that I picked up out. This is just a simple stretch. Oh, here's a pair of earrings. Little silver tone, that's pretty. Nice weight to it. Oh wait, that's not a pair, that's one. 
Well, we'll try and pair them up when I'm done. I think I'm going to put this in a plastic bag and when I'm done with all of them. Look at that pin. It's a, a safety pin pin. But it's got this rose on it that's three-dimensional. Isn't that pretty? It doesn't have a name on it, but I love that. That's like a, if you've got a big like wool scarf or something, this is nice to hold it together. Here is a pendant, no chain, a little kitty pendant. Is that Hello Kitty? You got a lot of pendants. Oh. You got a snowflake earring, but there's only one. I don't think we had another one. No, I don't see another one. For either one of those. And then there's a little hoop that this I don't see another one. This one I don't see another one. This one I don't see another one. So we'll put these all in a pile and I'll put them in a baggie. This one I don't see. Oh, I would have liked that too. It's very light. And this green one that I don't see another one. Well, we had, what, one pair of earrings? Two pair, maybe? Okay, that's one jar down. Let's do the other jar. Oh, here's another earring. Oh, now that's the third thing we've had that had clocks that we didn't have a match. Oh, that's not an earring. That's a pendant. Or it could be an earring. We'll put that over here with the pendants. All right. Let me get my scissors out. So get this one. Can you believe these were only $9? And I did actually leave an extra donation because they did have a donation jar because the table that was selling this was um uh for the church some church fund i don't remember what it said but so i did actually leave an extra donation because this is nine dollars is too cheap for these jars uh Somehow they got that bracelet in there. Don't want to come out. Come on, turn. There we go. All right, let's do this. This hunk of stuff. All right, this is a single pendant. Oh, that's a pretty star. I know you can't see it very well. It's so tiny. Put that up there with the pendants and the pins. Oh my goodness! Domino's Pizza, Coca Cola. Nashville something. It's got a date 1997. And I certainly can't read what the back says. That's cute. That would be nice for a jean jacket. All right, here's the one that I had trouble getting out. Oh, it's got a little side clasp to it. Let's see, it's like a bronze. Ooh, that's definitely size six and a half and seven. That's snug. Needs a little bit of cleaning. Looks like it had a sticker on it, and there's, you can see a little of the color wearing off there. A little wear to that one. Some of them don't look bad with a little wear. I don't know about this one. The... Still got stretch to it. That could be better. Just acrylic. Alright, what's this? This is an earring. Oh, let's hope the other one's in here somewhere. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ha! Look at those. Aren't they pretty? And those are just acrylic, but aren't they pretty? Oh, there's another pair. So it's what, two pair? Yep, that's two pairs so far. This is a pin. Oh, this is vintage. Look at this. It needs cleaning badly. Look at that. It's very well made. Vintage. I'll take a cloth to it and see if I can. I mean, I think it's supposed to be that smoky because this part is all shiny. The AB crystal, but we'll see if we can clean that up. Oh, fish. Got a little bit of wear on him. But the nice, oh, look at the pin back is different. Oh, 
the pin back. Very light, but you can see it has a little bit of wear, but it just brings the scales out where it's worn. Beautiful blue eye. It's very light. Not a expansive. Oh, I think I found a pair of earrings. Oh, and these are very, I would say, late 80s, 90s. They have like a, a mother of pearl look, but they're actually like faux enamel. And they are posts. Well, did we have this? Well, we'll put it down because this, this bag seems to have pairs. <gasps> look at the fish. That's three fish in one bag or two fish? Oh my goodness, he's so cute. And the pin works. It has a name on the back. Darned if I can see what it is. Hold on. No. Let's see if I can see through this. And people do it this way. I don't know how they do that. Because I can't see anything when I do that. Oops, wrong side. That's why you can't see anything. I'm just not talented enough to do that. What does that say? It's got a trademark. I'm going to have to take a picture with my camera and try and see what that is. But it does. It's a Jelly Belly green acrylic no glass green glass gold tone he's cute he's got a little green eyeball another earring earring oh we got a pair of these these are cute they're posts gold tone those are really cute Stylish. All right, put those in the pairs. Oh, that's a cute little butterfly. I hope we have another one of these. We have, I thought it was going to be a stick pin, but it's an extremely worn bobby pin. All right, we have another one of these. Just acrylic. Oh, this matches that earring. I hope we have the other, other butterfly. <gasps> yes, we do. Look at this. It's a set. Isn't that cute? Very nice. And a pretty chain. There's no name on them. But that is an adorable set. Put that to one side. Keep that together. I'll find a little baggie for that. Oh, is there only, oh no, there's two of these Halloween coming up and we have spiders. I have got these. I got these in another bag. When was that? I wonder if this woman shops where I shop. Because I got these in another bag. Are all the spiders there? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. It's just one's a little longer. I guess we could shorten that. But there's spiders. I have this somewhere. And unfortunately, I didn't. I meant to separate all my holiday stuff out, and I didn't. So I'm going to have to go through everything I own to separate out so I can have some holiday sale. It's a single earring, single earring, a broken bracelet with a very pretty medallion on it. Oh, it's a shame because that's pretty. Put that in the to be fixed up here. I have such a pile of to be fixed. This is some strange. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. This says circus. A little enamel charm. And then the pin. 
single layering, single layering. Oh, I can't believe it only had one of these. It looks like it had a tag on it, and it looks fairly new. Let's say purple. No, that's just a fuzzy. Purple suede and metal bead bracelet. Uh, I need to go get my coffee. Oh, this is pretty. I like these. These are not uh, anything brand name, but that's a cute one. It's got a stretch to it. Oh, it's got the little life tower on it. I like that. Purple beads. They're only acrylic, but I think I see a set of something. This is just acrylic, but those are pretty, pretty earrings. Aren't those cute? They spin around in there. Oh my goodness. They have kind of like a shell pack. Can you see that pattern to them? It's like a I don't know what it is. Almost a snake skin pattern. Let's see if I can get up here where you can see it close. Look at that. Those are cute. Those in the matched earring section. We'll do that last because I see some matches to earrings that we pulled out. We got these with little owls on the bottom. Those are real well glass. I think that's stone though. And that's cute. Matching. Then I see another matching pair over here. These are acrylic. These are vintage. Those are cute. This is wild pink thing that I don't see a match to. We have this pearl bracelet. little heart charm on it but it looks like it's broken I can fix that easy it just needs a hook on it all right what's all this little stuff here we'll wait for that because we got more in the jar and here it is stretch it is the biggest bracelet I have seen in stretch so gold tone it's got elephant after elephant, but it's also got, there's a lion, there's a kitty cat, another kitty cat, there's a giraffe, there's a rose, my goodness, this thing is huge, it's going to weigh a lot for shipping, look at all that stuff. And it's definitely like a size 7 or so. I'll have to get my thing out and check it before I sell it. But look at that. What a Costco bracelet that is. Oh, got some good bracelets out of this stuff. Let's get the tail end of this and see if... Oh, yuck. Club feathers. Probably wouldn't have picked up this jar if I saw those feathers. All right. Let's move this stuff over. Here's a Santa pin. It's one of those little hand painted little bell on the side. Here's a very inexpensive Tweety Bird watch. I don't know what kind it is. Can't read the clear. Not much into watches. Did like that ring one though. Okay, I'm back. I had a phone call. Okay, this is, I think this is, this is a gold necklace, but I think it's, it's got that hook at the bottom. I think it's for hanging your um, badge at work or something, or maybe you hang your glasses from it. I don't know, but it's inexpensive. But look at this, oh, another single earring. Look at this pendant. Isn't that gorgeous and agate? But I like the way it's got this gold side to it. You can wear it either side, I guess. 
But isn't that beautiful? And it's quite long, too. Look, it's three inches. That's a good one. That's a, getting some nice pendants and pins out of this. Okay, this has got feathers. I don't know what more I can say about it. It's inexpensive. It's cheap. But if you're really into feathers... Oh, it's missing one feather, so it's really not... I suppose you could take the one on the other, these two things off and just leave it like that. But, yeah, I'm not going to bother with it. Put it in the 2B torn apart pile. Okay, this is pretty. This is, I don't know if it's leather or faux leather. I have trouble with that. I think it might be faux leather, but it's one of these very simple bracelets. It looks nice. It's got nothing on there. Just a few scratches on it. It's worn, but that's cute. I wouldn't wear it that side out anyways. Another one of these magnetic ones. It's a pretty bracelet. It's just woven metal, like ribbon cord. That's nice. Uh, happy. This is a children's necklace. Oh my goodness. This is ceramic. Look how pretty that glaze is on that. Look at this here with the blues and the browns. It's a little coffee cup. That's about three inches too. That's cute. That's nicely made. Used to do ceramics. Pair of earrings. They're on a card, but it doesn't have a price on it. Brand new. I'm trying to see if that's a a picture in there or might just be glitter. There's another pair though. I'm not gonna complain about that. Here's a pendant on a nice silky silver chain. I don't see, oh, there is a tag. And that tag says what? Leah Sophia. That is a pretty one. That is a Leah Sophia necklace. So that goes in my, I didn't expect to see anything with a signature on it. But then I guess the people that donated might have put some stuff in here. This is a little gold chain. I'm not going to take it out. Oh, it's a little gold butterfly necklace. We're going to check it later. It's too delicate to play with. And this is a another bobby pin. This one's got faux pearls. Here is a gold tone. We got a little wear on it. Bow. It's kind of cute pin. A lot of pins out of this. I am surprised. This is very cheap and inexpensive. This thing here. What is it? And actually, cheap, inexpensive, and I think broken. Yeah, see, it's just really plastic chain with plastic beads. I'm going to throw that in the pile with the feathers. All right, this is a glass. Oh, that's pretty. Look how pretty that is. It's got the, oh my goodness. It's got the dichroic glass and the glitter. And we're going to see if we can figure out how this goes. This goes this way. I can't believe I've got. Three more of these and a large one to go. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful? I love that. It's like a gold stone in it. And the shape is so pretty. And those beads that they used. Of course, there's no name on this one because these are usually handmade. that over here. I'm going to have to take pictures of some of this stuff. Oh, look at this pin. 
Oh my goodness, this is the cutest pen ever. Looks enamel. I think it's that faux enamel though, but look at that. He has little rhinestones in his ear. A little black matted rhinestone. And little bitty rhinestones in his trunk and on his feet. Is that the cutest elephant ever? Oh my goodness, that's adorable. Ah. Okay, found a pair of earrings. Those are pretty. Got a yellow tone to them with flowers embedded in them. I've seen a pair like this not that long ago either. Somewhere in one of my now see this is it I should be separating out the Christmas stuff and the Halloween stuff and I should have been doing it all along and I haven't I wish I had now you look at this this is a gorgeous Christmas necklace it says Noel it's good quality is it Avon looks like it could be yes it is Avon I should have been separating these out all along but I haven't been. This one's pretty. Those pearls have got a gorgeous tone to them. Pearlescent. Well, they are pearls. All right, this is a little bitty delicate bracelet. Or maybe that could be an anklet. Let me see how long it is. It is... Yeah, this is, this is an anklet. And that is adorable. It's got a little stone in there. Just so cute. And a little bobble at the end. Put that to one side so I don't put it in with the bracelets. What's this? This is another one of those um, that has a thing on the bottom. And I, like I said, I think they're either for... Oh, it has a knot in it too. I think they're either for glasses or hanging your work badges from. This one's cute. It's faux turquoise. All right, let's see what we've got. And that's these two. And like I said, we're going to have to save all these earrings because I don't know if they're going to be in the other jars or not. She said they just had a session where they sat down and, and all together put, put stuff together. So do I see any of these up there? Oh, this is a shark's tooth. Needs to be wire wrapped. I'll put that up there with the pendants. All right, here's a pair of earrings right here. Oh, these are pretty. Look at these. Little posts. See how pretty those are? They're little posts. Look like they're well made, too. They've got all their stones. Those are Christmas earrings, I think. All right, what else have we got? We got this pair. Ooh. Those look sterling to me. I'm going to put those aside to be checked. Because don't those... Those definitely look sterling to me. I'll put them aside and check them. Put them over here for now. We have two more stick pins. We have this little muskrat beaver or whatever. We have this little heart. I've never seen so many stick pins ever. All right, will we have this gray one anywhere? No. How about this? Do we have, no? Oh, we have it, but they're, they're falling out of, they didn't come out of the jar, so they must have been like that when they put them in. Oh, wait a minute. Nope. I don't see any more pearl ones that came out of it. Well, that's a shame. And we have this single pearl one. So these are all the single ones. Which is quite a few. I was hoping we'd find this one. This is a nice earring. Look at that. Nice quality. And this is a pendant, actually. It doesn't have an earring thing on it. So I'm going to stick it over with the pendants. Okay. This too. 
thought this was an earring. This is a pendant. All right. We'll put these up in a plastic bag. Thank you for viewing this video. That was two jars worth. That was $18 worth of jewelry. And I think we did well. I think we did well. I have no complaints about this. So, thank you very much for viewing my video. I will now put the little thing on the end of it with the, um, the winner of the which I haven't done yet. See, this is um, Friday, and I'm going to be sending this video out Sunday, and Sunday at noon is when I'm going to draw the winner. So by the time I send this out at 3 o'clock or so on Sunday, I'll have this little snippet of the winner. And like I said, I'm going to do another one probably next week. I'm going to start another one, and I run them for two weeks, and you comment on the video where I start them, which will be the next video, next Wednesday's video comment on that video and you've got two weeks the following Wednesday at noon I'll draw the winner for that one so thank you very much for viewing my video and please subscribe if you can you have a lovely day okay so we're set it up random comment there's the video 22 comments. We're going to pick a winner. Okay, so Susie Thompson is the winner. So I'm going to get a screenshot of this so that I can paste it down below. And that is the winner.